Hello all my crafty friends, Purple Nanny here. I'm really, really so sorry that I've not been on until now. Um, I had a trip down to Devon, which was absolutely amazing to see my family and um, it just knocked, it just knocked me for six with all the travelling. I was absolutely shattered when I got home and I just had no energy whatsoever and I'm still finding it really, really difficult to get motivated if you if you like. Um I've been crafting, I've been doing bits and pieces. I'll I'll show you what I've been doing. Um and I've made a few purchases. So without further ado, I'd like to introduce to you the Tonic Crafters Magnetic Die Stand. Now this is absolutely massive. I wasn't expecting it to be so big. Um, and I made up. It's just that I'm going to have to make room for it. Um, for when I use it on my desk. So you just open it out like so. And then you stand it up like that and then all your magnetic things fit to you and it's 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 amazing it's absolutely massive I can't when I go through my dies and um, that I've bought I'll show you um but yeah really really chuffed pieces with that and it falls away nicely for storage so yeah that is brilliant for when you're doing big projects and you're going to be using uh, uh, the die a few times, like your memory books and things like that. So yeah, there's that. Then I treated myself to the new blending mat, which is for your stencils. So, and this is this. This is this. Doggers everywhere. Sorry, guys. Um, no matter what you do, you get doggers, catters. Anyway, this is absolutely amazing. Um, the magnetic, the magnets are brilliant, and I ordered two more sets of them um, because I have a few things on the go and just trying to find the other packet with the yeah, where they are underneath everything so there's them two so I ordered them as an extra um, for when I'm doing different projects because I, I do a lot of um, work with small stencils like this so these are just ideal for when you're doing your um, ATCs and things so you can have a few on the go which is big enough to do that so I'm absolutely chuffed with that um, these small ATCs size um masks mini masks mini stencils rather are from creative expressions and this is the, the ones that i got one was called art deco thing yeah art deco dots and dashes giraffe print um hourglass then you've got large polka dots, tiles, and scattered diamonds. So that's what I've got there. So that's uh, some other things I've got. Now I am going to rant and rave. This thing, magnetic magic mat from scrapbook.com. I've never even heard of it. And I was on John Bloodworth's... Um, YouTube channel and I seen him advertise it and thought oh, I've got to get this and I've already got the precision plate 
for it's one all I use now is a precision precision plate and this you don't use any of the plastic um the plastic shims anymore sorry about that I just want to show you my plastic shim if I can get past um, I must have put it on the floor. I thought to put it back so I could show you, so I could find it and show you. But you all know how the plastic shims go, guys. The I used my one of them that much that it absolutely snapped in half. Um, and and as you can see, I've used this quite a bit. And it is absolutely brilliant. You just do your normal sandwiches and you use this instead of a cutting a cutting plate and it fits your big shot. And you know how much I love my big shot. So yeah, you just turn it, keep turning it as you're using it. And it will go warp like that because you know it's obvious it's it's going through your machine but absolutely brilliant don't know why I'm losing my voice and why I'm breathless all the time but yeah it's from scrapbook.com so that is an absolute bargain and it was how much was it do you know what I don't know I can't I can't put a price, it was it $24.99 and then you'd add shipping on top of that. I think it was just under £30. It sounds a lot but it's just going to last you forever and it, it, you, you'll never buy any plates again. Um, and also I got this free with it from scrapbook.com, this pad full of all different colours. So that's that. Um, now, my makes, what I've been making, I ordered five of these from um, Indigo Blue because they've not had them in stock for ages. So I bought five of them just so I've got enough. And they are, that's what it is. That's what you make. And they are two... Put your collector's stamp, collector's editions from Indigo Blue, they fit in there perfectly. So, and the collector's edition stamps were on number 49 at the minute. So there's like 49 stamps and I've got every single one of them and they're all placed <coughs> in there. And every single box that I've made of these, I think this is the fifth box I've made, have been completely different. One I've put nutshells on, another one I've put cogs on, um, another one I'm going to do buttons, another one I have put embossed the UT on top and embossed it and heat embossed it. And this one's paint and I'm going to put crackle crackle medium over that so that that cracks so yeah that's what that is that turns into that so that's what I've been making and that's what I've painted um I have been to my friends Denise again and I she has given me a, a mound a, a ton of stuff again absolutely loads of stuff and one of the one of the things that she's given me is this like menu and like a, a notice board so it comes in two pieces you get two um, stencils um, you get family home and there's another one love and she also gave me a load of um, 
imagination crafts starlight paints and these are absolutely stunning they are the best paints I have ever worked with and I can't find them online to get more colours but they are absolutely stunning and she gave me I think it was um, six bottles all different colours absolutely beautiful and that's what I've been doing I've been as you can see I've used them too and colours which is that blue <clears throat> and this one is dark orchid which is a deep deep purple and it's absolutely gorgeous and they've got flake they've got flakes in the paint and it gives off like a shimmer I don't know whether you can see that but yeah that's the back so I'm in the middle of making them and that that goes on that stand and you put a chalkboard put a chalkboard on after you've stenciled all around and then you've got your little menu thing for what you're going to do that day or um, do a smaller one for a shopping list or just put these on home and family there's all sorts you can do so I'm having fun and games with that because you know how much, I'm, how much I love my mixed media and yeah so Denise is so kind to give me them I've also been um, doing plaques I've done a plaque for my friend across the road of the Volkswagen Golf that I did one for my brother didn't I last summer I don't know if you've seen that video but I did that one and so now I'm doing ones for me for my garden and this is one that I finished there's a ballerina and love hearts and butterflies so that's one and these are the ballerinas that I'm getting ready to um, do on this one um, that's going to be something like that or even that one up there and that one down there that's better so these are all going in in my garden because as you've I don't know whether you you know but I used to be a dancer so they're going to be pride of place in in the garden and they've all been um, treated so they can go outside so that's what that's another thing that what I've been up to other purchases I've, I've bought I've, um, these this one I got off crafts for less um, it is a new stamp set from crafters companion photo polymer and it is called um, I don't know it's all in different language it's not even in English I don't even know what it's called Wild Bloomings Fleurs Salvagers Fleurs Silverstrees and Wild Bluting it's not even in English So I don't, I'm sorry guys, I don't know what the stamp's called. But it's a, it's a frame. And you can put your own sentiments in the middle. So. A world without flowers is like a face without a smile. That's nice, isn't it? Thinking of you. So yeah, I got her out of that. And then out of the other set that she's brought. Sarah. I ordered this. That's a coffee stain on it. Oh, scruffy. Scruffy all what? You got a die and you got a stamp set. These are not photopolymer. So you got a truck. I thought it was really, really funny because there's 
four bunnies there on that stamp and meet my son that lives in the Netherlands has just bought some bunnies for his um, apartment him and his girlfriend Sophie have just bought bunnies <laughs> so I'll have to make them a car to those on so that's what that is it's a truck and coffee spilt all over it because of Maggie about an hour ago and knocked my coffee over Another thing I bought from Crafter's Companion is this bag. It came with the magazine. That's the only reason why I got it. The magazine was because I wanted this bag dye. And it's quite big, guys. It's um, it's quite nice. That's the dyes. I've not made, not made it up yet. But yeah, you need the large Gemini for that. That tells you on the back. From um, Sue Wilson's dye collection, new dye collections. I got these. This is a new release. This is a stamp and die where you put ink on that and you dye it, you you die cut it. I've not used it yet. Um and I can imagine that to be absolutely gorgeous. So these are just dies. And there's your the dies there. And then I got this. I was like, I wasn't expecting this to be as big as it was, so I was made up. Postage stamp frame, it's called. Absolutely gorgeous. I love um, Creative Expressions and Sue Wilson stars. This I got from Create and Craft. Um, it was a magazine thing in the magazine. You um, put the cord in. And you got them dies. I thought that was a nice little die set. This and where's the other one? Oh, don't say I've lost it. I'll find it when I come back. And that's the other set that I got <clears throat> with the Sue Wilson's new release. With the um die storage thing you've got two dies two die sets one's just thinking of you I think it says on it it's just a die and, the, and then you've got this one as well so you've got like two sets and it says I'm sorry I forgot I'm so sorry it's late so you can swap and change all different different sorries so you've got that die set and another little one I might come across it as I'm showing you all the bits and pieces. Um, this one was a member's gift from Create and Craft, which is a paper pack from the Paper Boutique. I love their, their paper pads. Also from the Sue Wilson collection, I ordered the 3D embossing folders, which is Twill Weave and Geo Trellis. I thought they were unusual. Um, and from Sizzix, I got I got a couple of sets, but I've put them away. I got the butterflies, and the, I got this half moon oh, I can't even think what it's called um, trying to think what else uh, I got this stamp set and there was a um, 12 by 12 um, paper pad as well and a stencil that I've used I've not used stamps yet and that was another, uh, that was a pick of the day from Crate and Craft. From Tonic, I got the Stamp Club, which is the Wales and, let me tell you the name of it. It's called a Whirly Great Stamp Set. 
So you've got the dies, I love that, with all the fish. Oh, you can see that. I hope it's not glaring too much. And the whales. You can. Absolutely gorgeous. Stamp set, photo polymer. And a new, the new stamp club is coming out tomorrow, so hopefully I'll be getting that as well. Now, <clears throat> this die set, um, two die sets I've got here, is off a lady that's got a YouTube channel. And she's from the Netherlands, and oh my god, she's amazing. She does her own, she's got her own, like, um, shop on well it's not her own shop i think she designs it for a shop and she sells her dies there so there's like that's like a, a box and you, you die cut two of them and and this is like a box with like an envelope and you've got like a that's the flap of the envelope so i've not i've not made them up yet but yeah i think her name's louise I think I'm so sorry if it's not Louise but she's from the Netherlands and she's amazing and I absolutely love watching her she's so she does all her videos live um yeah she's really really nice so and everything that you know she advertises she gives you um links so you can go go ahead and buy them uh, I was at Asda yesterday and I got myself two um, fish pens. So treated myself to some of them. And also I got the Die Cutting Essential magazine. And in that in that magazine, let me move this over to the side. In that magazine you got this gorgeous die art deco die set and then and you've got a six by six folder also i got the creative stamping and with that you got this stencil and Lisa Hart and stamp set, message in a bottle. Um, as I said before, I got the Crafters Companion magazine because it this bag went with it. And in this this one, you got a die set, set of stamps, really cute hedgehogs and an embossing folder so yeah we've got like don't know what that says should say there no. um, with love And also from Asda, I took myself to the New Tonic magazine as well. And in that magazine, you got <clears throat> you got you got you got you got this brilliant stencil stamp set and this die set with, with balloons actually my bag is stuck to this there's a balloon, helicopter, an aeroplane and there's all sorts in there okay yeah so anyway that's it that's all i'm going to do i've got more stuff there but i think i, I must be boring you now um 
I'd hopefully, fingers crossed, I'll be doing more um, videos and show and tell and show you things that I've been making and that. And I just really, really am so sorry that I've not been on until now. I did get uh, this month's tonic, um, but the new one's due out next week, so I'm just going to leave it until then. So that was good timing. I'll speak to you again soon. Bye guys. Take care.